Any of you guys with a full, healthy head of hair might want to ignore this part. But for the rest of us, I want to talk a little bit about bald spots. But you can never be fully prepared for a bald spot. They kind of creep up on you. And they come up from behind, so you're usually the last one to even find out. About. And I believe that a bald spot is uh, some alien life form of some type. It's a lot more sensitive than the rest of your skin. I mean, the sun burns real easy. It's the first thing to feel cold or rain. It's the first thing to sweat if you're in trouble or eating Mexican food or both. I think it's because uh, it's a lot younger than the rest of your skin. I mean, everything else is maybe 50 years old, but your bald spot's only been around for the last three. That's why it's so smooth and perky. <laughs> so instead of thinking of a bald spot as an embarrassing sign of old age and rampant decay, why don't you think of it as sexy? Huh? <laughs> they say hair loss is from having too much testosterone, so that's a pretty good start. And I've already established that it's smooth and real sensitive. So I'm suggesting that a bald spot is the ultimate erogenous zone. <laughs> A powerful love badge that's only given to the most manly of men. <laughs> there. Now do you feel better about your bald spot? <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> Remember, I'm pulling for you. We're all in this together. Uh, hey, everybody. Um, I've been doing this tour. I did it last year called I'm Not Old, I'm Ripe. And it's almost over. I'm going to do maybe seven or eight more dates. They're all going to be in America, some on the East Coast, some Midwest, and so on. They're not all together arranged yet, but some of them are. Like, I've got four of them are on sale now. I think one's in uh, Shipshawana, Indiana, one's in Des Moines, Iowa, one's in Frederick, Maryland, and the other one's in Virgins, Vermont. And like I say, it'll be three or four more coming. Go to redgreen.com and check the details. This will be the end of this tour. If you haven't seen it, um, it's it's pretty good. I've I've been to almost all the shows and they're and they're and they're pretty good. So hopefully I'll see you down the road. Take it easy.